Ladies and gentlemen, Perfection has returned to the realm of Xenoverse 2. And today we're going to be talking about DLC Pack 9 because we got some new information that is somewhat interesting and somewhat dissatisfying at the same time. So if you, you've been living under a rock, we got confirmation or semi-confirmation because it is from a reputable source. I won't lie, this is the same source that has leaked other... Uh, news about DLC for Xenoverse 2, but uh, the word is we're getting Super Saiyan God Vegeta. Now, on one hand, it's like, yeah, new character, Super Saiyan God Vegeta, and on the other hand, it's like, yay, another Vegeta. You know, there's more, more than likely won't play any differently. You know, and the one thing that I'm interested in with DLC Pack 9. That DLC Pack 9 must have. If you want this DLC to be remembered, if you want this DLC to be a success, there is one character that you need to add Chile. Chile, 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 Chirai, whatever you want to call her, you have to add her. She is a necessary ingredient to the recipe of success for Xenoverse 2. Like, okay, Super Saiyan God Vegeta is like, whatever. I know a lot of people want him, and I feel like he could have just been a by-the-by addition. Like, oh yeah, by the way, Vegeta's getting a new slot in which he's a Super Saiyan God on his Super Saiyan Blue uh, character. Because we know that they're going to have the same combos. It's just the difference between red hair and blue hair. I, I really, unless he's going to have some new combos and he's going to be OP online, I really don't care. That's just me, personally. But Chile has the potential to be a great new character because, and I don't want to hear anyone say, well, she didn't even fight. Jacko didn't even fight. And he's in the game. They have the possibility to take a lot of liberty with this character that a lot of people argue is the fan service of the Broly movie, which I, I definitely don't see it. I just see Chile being a family-friendly uh, understudy character to Broly or uh, uh, Le Le uh, what's his name Lego Legumo or something uh, part of that little uh, trio of friends but she could be interesting in Xenoverse 2 like if you wanted to make her a better Jocko you could make her a better Jocko I mean she could use her blaster she could actually have useful moves she could have like fan servicey combos and different stuff like that like think of Zangya from Rage and Blast 2 because she has some interesting combo animations that were great and I could see Chile coming in and just being that character that's like okay she could either be a fun gag character or she could be a oh low key she's OP and she's good in Xenoverse 2 who would have thunk it type of character now if you're hyped for Super Saiyan God Vegeta that's whatever now I don't really think there's any other characters that they can add into DLC pack 9 uh, if this is gonna be another Dragon Ball Super Broly themed DLC uh, the only character outside of Chile Super Saiyan God Vegeta I mean, they could add Fury Form Broly. They definitely could. But uh, I don't know. I mean, I think the time has passed for that. Like, they should have had Fury Form Broly first. And then Super Saiyan Full Power. But it's like, you know, that's... I mean, Chile is definitely one that they need to go with. If you want a completely new character, if you want to boost up the female character slots... Chile is the one. That's all I'm going to say. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video, the discussion. What do you think? Do you think the other character will be Chile or do you think we're only getting stuck with Super Saiyan God Vegeta, which I feel like would be a terrible DLC character? Just him alone. This is what I'm saying. Him alone would be terrible. But if he got uh, something like Chile and those were the two characters that we were going with I wouldn't mind having Super Saiyan God Vegeta but that's just me anyways let me know your thoughts down in the comment section below of course I've been your perfect being and the number one anime gaming Dragon Ball and journalism channel on YouTube the quality is in name itself perfection and I will see you in the next Xenoverse 2 video peace